So with Power World's new update on the way, I want to make sure my base is in the best possible condition it can be. To do that though, I need to head over to the Forbidden Area. I'm missing a few pals still, but the one I'm looking for is this pretty lady in a dress. Criminal activity on the way. Man. Who narked already? I've been here for like four seconds. Not even getting the pal to spawn in that I want. I kind of had a feeling she'd be a rare spawn. I just fly. Uh, to the moon and then plummet back down like a tiny little meteorite. You think that'll redo the spawns for these guys? Looks like, because I don't remember Astagon being anywhere here before. Or this weird bird. Ow. It's a fun game of how many loops does it take before I can get what I want. Oh, Shadow Beak. What are you doing over here, buddy? Oh, there she is. Finally. It only took me 200. Wow. I didn't think that was going to kill her. Hey. No, it's not my fault. Here, I'll try this again but we'll pepper her this time. Oh, legendary sphere. Oh, that's a perfect catch rate. All right, we're out of here. Spirit Emperor, oh my God. But looky, she's a level four planting, level three medicine and level three handiwork. You know, if I just upgraded her, she'd be better than like five of these things combined, which is exactly why you're going in the pit. You know, this is gonna seem a little weird, but if I take Crockpot, who has three of the four stats that I want, throw you in there. And if I were to breed that with this cosmic little being, We'll give them a sec to make an egg. A few moments later. We'd get our huge verdant egg, which when incubated gives me Vitalia. With serious, we can do better than that. Attempt number two, work slave muscle head. That's still not quite what we're needing. Also, totally different thing. I need to take this big old gum off. Throw you in there. Get giant acorn. You might be one of my favorite pals, buddy. God, the inside of your mouth is so textured. Oh, it's disturbing. Norman Tide, you're fired for a sec. But if I were to breed these two together, they would also give me a Patalia, which should, keyword, should, give me all four stats that I need to put into my ultimate gardener. And I realized I tried to make some cakes, but Crockpot's kind of busy. Here you go, buddy. Take a break from cooking and go cook and stuff. All right, give me a good Patalia to work with. That sucks. Give me a better Patalia to work with. That's better, yeah. Mm, maybe I am addicted to games for how many times I do this. Serious artisan work slave? Ooh, that's nice. This works though, because I just need to take my big green panda moss anda. I'm going to set you in there for now. Why did I chuck you so far? Anyway, they have artisan. We'll see if this one egg I had was able to make me a lucky patalia. Answer yes with a bunch of other junk stats. We'll throw you in there though to see if we can pull lucky artisan out of these two. Crackpot, you look pleased as can be. More reasons other than making 29 cakes I can only assume, but thank you for these. We'll say 10 tries. I want me to help speed this process up. I know where this guy lives. Can you- whoa, whoa, why did he shake his head like that? Oh no, no, don't fireball them. These guys are too weak and stupid to survive most hits. But I only want to do this just in case I can catch something, you know, more towards my breeding standards. In breeding, important to have options. Do you guys survive a missile shot, maybe? Yes? Probably because you're so big. Oh, you're dead. Sorry about that. Alright, I probably got enough to test. Here, have a missile strike. Yeah, I feel good enough to go home now. Got eight versions Verdant eggs to play with. Something nice and good. Nope. You know, spit in my face. That's an option. Huh? That is an option. We went 0 for 8 on getting lucky. Guess that checks out in a cruel kind of way. Wait, time out. I've gotten an artisan serious Patalia, so if I can get a lucky work slave Mossanda, everything would work fine. You know, some of the stats that good old Crockpot has. Dump you in there, buddy. Actually, bit change of plans. Normal Jormantide go in. And then I have my nice old Surfant Terra. Hey, we don't have to have a party in the pen. They're about to start doing stuff you don't want to be here for. But this should hopefully give me a lucky Mossanda in that it's pretty clear. I just need the lucky Mossanda to be female and then I combine it with this Patalia uh, and then I should get a four out of four Lilene. It's that easy, right? <laughs> I'm going to be here for three hours. Oh, God. So five verdant eggs later, will I be a happy man or will I have to go on a murderous rampage? Runner lucky and work slave, huh? huh? Oh wait, I just had a completely different egg. Oops. Whoops. Now I'm back on the Moss Andas. Nope. nope, that was Lilene again. I'm confused. I've been hatching so many things. Oh, that one's got lucky with two negatives. That can't be good. That's another negative. That's, wow. Why do they hate me so much? Some things I might just never get the answer to. Okay, uh, I don't trust my luck. 
at all. But throwing that Mossanda in that defies gravity with Lucky and three other stats I don't want to talk about, and this male Patalia with the other three, I've got 14 chances at greatness. Um, please do something useful. What do I need to make more cakes? Also, what did I run short on? Eggs, but I'm about to run out of honey and flour. Maybe it's time for me to make another wheat plantation. How are we doing down here? Bunch of honey, 366. Good enough for me. Now, where's my red merchant? Give me 933 eggs. Seems like a reasonable amount, yeah. I really do just need more flour, but at least I'm good on everything else for now. That's fine. Maybe the game will be kind to me, and I'll just have what I need uh, instantly. Lucky? No. Actually, this is kind of good. If I can just divvy the stats up into twos, I can breed Lyleens together to get what I need arguably a lot quicker. So far though, game hates me, wants me dead. Ooh, lucky artisan. So this Lyleen has lucky work slave, which, oh, I can't throw you at all. Wow, you weigh a ton, huh? Get in there. I'll obviously still need another stat, but this one has lucky artisan. Well, that's some other stuff. So I'm just gonna try and also breed these two side by side. That way I can hopefully get some cross pollination going and get what I need. It, did you get it? Cause they're plants, cross pollination. A little science joke for you. All right, my next five, what do we got? That's just two negative stats. That's nothing good. You will be fodder. Can I see, whoa, just blanket artisan? That's really good. Let me see blanket serious or not. Spit in my face. Sure. Sure, sure, sure. Ooh, lucky Zen mine. Actually, not bad. The game didn't give me anything good. My life is a cycle of waiting 20 minutes and coming back to check things. This is okay, though. I have eight eggs. I believe in the luck of the draw. The game Bruh. spits in my face yet again. That's Blanket lucky. Give me blanket work slave, blanket serious. I'll do the rest. Or you give me a work slave serious Lyleen. That's an option too. And where? One for eight. All right. Lucky work slave serious, bottomless stomach. Really? Whoa, I didn't even see I actually had just blanket work slave. New plan. You have lucky. You have a work slave. This is a runner artisan. Not proud of it. But I'm going to combine it with one of the only serious Lyleens that I have and see if I can make something good. Crockpot, my slimy red lizard. Lizard. Incidentally, my nickname in high school. Huh? I got 11 more cakes over here calling your name, buddy. Flap those little wing skills. How does your anatomy work, actually? Let's talk about it. Here, you both get three. This will be very worth it, or I am coping. It's only ever those two options. On to my next two. Pulling lucky and nothing else. Okay, wow, so bad. Then just lucky, nothing else. I want to impale this sword through my chest. The next day. All right, a little bit later, I've got my next four. If I don't get what I need out of these seven eggs, a small village will no longer exist. And that's lucky stronghold strategist. Well, it's the game putting the village in harm's way, not my fault. Why is he giving me lucky diet lover? It's toying with me. It's literally dangling keys in front of me like I'm an infant. Ooh, lucky work slave. That's pretty good. Serious and lucky, yes. So I got serious lucky. Now I need artisan work slave, like a child making a Lego tower, but it's genetics. So now these two should give me an artisan work slave in the next few cakes. Just kind of how math works. Works. I don't know what the numbers are. I just know they're in there somewhere. 10 more done, crock pot. They'll sing your name forever, buddy. All right, I put in three eggs. Let's just assume I'll be able to get what I'm wanting in the first three. Nope. That way I can save some cake time. I thought I had it, but it's just swift from out of nowhere. I hate it. It's scary and dark in here. Oh, okay, thank you, Lyleen. Never go under Lyleen's dress thing. And where are these other three stats coming from? Just artisan work slave. That's all I want to see. That's one regular work slave. I'll spit in your eyeball. Screw it. Take the next seven. I'll just start doing things extreme. Break these wheat seed farms. Just place four more down right there. There. I just put three Lyleens in with three Azerobes. That'll be automatic wheat seed wheat generation. You get it. Hang on, sorry. I forget you guys get stressed. All right, six more eggs to try and get two stats off of the parents. They both only have one trait. Why it's being difficult, I don't know, but I will be writing a formal letter and it's not gonna be worded nicely. There it is. Now I just have to hope that their genders coincide. Oh, I got another one. Was it the formal letter that I threatened to send? Oh, the genders align. I've never doubted the game's ability to love me once. Flashback. If I don't get what I need out of these seven eggs, 
a small village will no longer exist. End of flashback. Get in there, Lileen. One, where'd your sister go, brother? Well, maybe I... No, I'd, I'd take that back. Where'd your complete stranger counterpart go? Stay. Now, if all goes well, I should get my perfect four for four, like I'm ordering from a Wendy's menu. I've only got five cakes for now, but you two will just have to make it work. Or I get it in my very first try. Oh, but wouldn't it have been cool? All right, I'll come back in a bit. 20 minutes later. So I was waiting around for a while, and then I realized, um... I've got a lot of stuff to sell. That's 125 grand. Oh, what is this? I can just buy wheat. Oh, what do you know? There's 999 of it. Ooh. There, make me 343 flour when you get a chance. Let me also open up my last four eggs in case a miracle occurs and I beat the odds. What did that do? Oh, 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 I beat the odds. Oh, I beat the odds. That took me two eggs. Why did I revert back to monkey right there? <laughs> Game, want to give me another one by chance? That'd be cool if you did that. That was a three. I mean, that's pretty close. Why, you know, why not one more? Why not one more? Nope. Said three in a different way. Say hello to Mr. Green. With a work speed boost of 115%, thanks to all of the skills that you see here, Mr. Green also partakes in minor cannibalism. What? Immediately just make it two stars. I can probably just immediately get rid of both my Patalias as well. Mr. Green, hop on in. I want to go see how you farm and do stuff. You're only two stars. I don't have you boosted. I mean, that's a quick rate. I mean, that's, that's still going to go up like an extra 70%, but still that's already much better. How long does it take you to plant things? Planting is what really takes up time. That's, whoa, whoa. Yeah, that's great. Now, if I want to make sure Mr. Green can be the best he can be, I need to fly around and open up these chests. Luckily, the desert is kind. That's commonly said uh, wherever you go. But basically, you can get medium pal souls out of these chests, which I will be needing for the future. Whoa, secret mine shaft. Who's in here? Oh, it's just a stupid black marketeer. There's a chest back here though. Neat. Oh, and what do you know? While I was trying to gather medium pal souls, I found another effigy. How many more of those am I missing? Well, there was at least one more right here, so. Ooh, shiny Rayhound. You wanna come hang out with me for an eternity? I know the answer is yes. You can stay in that ball. Oh, wow, 7%. That's not great. Let's try this one. 15%. What's with these luckies? Oh, that was a one shot too many. Whoops. Let's leave. Leave the scene of the crime. Desiccated mine shaft? Dude, what's in this one? I just came here for medium souls. We're finding all sorts of little secrets. Oh, big scorpion. How does fireball do? Decent. How about Beam Comet? My special move. That seems to be doing a bit more. How about my special move? Six AR bullets. Yeah, that seemed effective. You want to stay in the thing, buddy? You're new to me. 40%. One jiggle. Sick. Try that again, but this time you stay in the ball. Ready? Go. Thank you. 69%. I was about to lose. Are you kidding me? Oh, Menacing is also just not new to me. Big one in here is, though. How did I forget about that guy? These goldfish really gotta do a better job of remembering stuff. Honey, I'm back from war. We got a bunch of flour now. Crock pot. You know what that means. Get over here. 47 cakes await. It doesn't matter anymore. I'm just using Lilene's as breeding fodder. Right. I think this one extra egg should be the last one I need to take Lilene over to the next level. Yeah, 32 in inventory. And that's exactly what we need to do now. Get consumptioned. Now the only thing standing between me and my beautiful working factory is 64 cakes. Which we're at another 20. That's a pretty close amount. Cook faster, crockpot. Cook faster. A few minutes later. I'm back with more flour for crockpot. Pot to make 19 more eggs. I think that actually might be enough to get Mr. Green up to the max four star. I didn't really do the math. I'm just going off vibes. We as a society should do that more often. All right, things have been going pretty smoothly along so far. I'm gonna absolutely speed incubate these next few eggs because looks like I'm just four short. So if I put these other four back in. Oh, looks like they had some eggs ready for me anyways. Now it looks like we're ready to murder a small village. See, we've come full circle. Goodbye, every other Lilene. Now Mr. Green is planting level five, handiwork level four, medicine production level four, and gathering three. But of course, that's not all. We come over here, we can upgrade the work speed a few times. I'm a few large pal souls short, but that brings the work speed up to 191. So we Saw how fast harvesting was earlier. How about now? Okay, mm yeah, it's like what? Triple that speed as last time? That's cool. That's very, very cool. That was just their gathering speed. Hey, do the planting speed. Okay, yep, yeah, nope, that's done now. And then it's on to the next. Yeah, I've just got an absolute monster. My base is coming along pretty nicely now, though, for the new raid boss that's coming out. If you have any other suggestions for me in Power World, leave me a comment down below letting me know. Until then, as always, thanks so much for watching. I'll see ya.